good day and welcome to my channel my name is for Le. and in this video i want to show you the best settings for what for rear q so come to think of it many people you've been seeing their videos out there some people will tell you the best settings for 100 dollars the best settings for 200 dollars best setting for 300 dollars best setting for 1000 or 500 dollars or 50,000 dollars for rear q robot but come to think of it let's take for example you have 100 usd you traded with 100 usd it grew to 200 we have to run back uh to watch a video on 200 how to do the settings for 200 usdt no that shouldn't be so so in this video what i want to do i want to show you the perfect settings the way to do what to set to do your settings for what for the royal q robot so because of the amount you have maybe you have 500 you have 1000 you have 2000 you have 3000 you do what you have the monopoly over your money and you have the right to set whatever you want to set so the first thing i want you to do is this you have to come to what quantitative and uh, you've heard a lot of things but i based on what i do i like to do what to buy a coin that has dipped well enough but some people will tell you like uh, okay it's better to buy a coin that is green maybe under four percent five percent yes you can do that there's no uh issue with doing that but i lo love to buy coins that are deep so the first thing i will do is i will click on this and i want to see based on negative i want to see the coins that are currently losing and you can see we have a uh, btc sdst we have zts z xtz we have bnb we have atom we have dot and the likes so you can do what you can choose whichever you want to choose but i won't choose this one because some of them have a trade horn i will choose dot and use that as an explanation for you so let me choose this and also one thing i want you to know is this after knowing the coin i want to trade here there's a way i also confirm that this is a coin through which i can make money so let me just take you to the coin market app and show you that so before i go ahead to trade this coin what i want to do is i want to confirm that it's actually a perfect coin for me to trade so what i will do is this i will just uh, go to coinmarketcap.com just as you can see and since what i intend trading is dot i'll just type it there and i'll select whichever the coin you wish to trade you can also do that so i'll scroll down to the charts and i'll at first what check the one day uh charts and as you can see you can see this 42.99 here and it has dropped and dropped and dropped and you can see it's trying to do what to start a bullish run back here but that is not what I'm concerned about. That has been catered for when uh, I actually checked in the qualitative part of the Royal Q robots. What I want to do now is I want to check how volatile this coin is because I will actually be wasting my time if I am trading a coin that is not volatile. So to do that, I want to be certain that this is not just making a few run and everything what will change at a particular point in time. So I will go, I can come to seven days. You can see that there is actually what there is movement, there is active movement. If I go to one month, you can see there is what there is active movement. If I go to three months, you can see there is active what movement. So with this. I can see yes, this is a reliable coin for me to watch for me to trade. So let's continue with the Real Q trading part. So now that we have we are back and I've showed you how to confirm that this coin is viable on coin market app, what I would do is this I will just use dots and once I do that, I'll come for trade settings. And once I come for the trade settings, what I will do is this. I will set my first buy in a month. So you have one thousand dollars, you have ten thousand dollars, you have five hundred dollars. What you want to do is just ensure that the cumulative amount of your first buy amount 
and your margin the, your margin call limit and the margin configuration is not more than what you have it's as simple as that let's you have one thousand dollars yes if you have one thousand dollars you can just put what you can put if you like you can put 500 usd if that's what you want to trade you can move 500 usd but once you put 500 usd it simply means your magic call limit must not be what must not be more than one and once it's not more than one it also means your margin configuration must not be more than one multiple buy ratio must not be one. it simply means uh whenever it wants to buy at another dip of 3.5 percent it should open just one position which is 500 then 500 plus 500 is 1000 it's as simple as that and what if you want to do what you want to use let's say you want to use 1000 you want to use let's say 1000 then you should have no what no margin call limits but though this is not something advisable to do i'm just saying so let's take for example and you now want to trade with a certain amount i will always advise you to do what to trade with more than one coin take for example you have one thousand dollars you can trade two coins you can trade three coins you can trade four coins yes so if you trade four coins with one thousand dollars it simply means you want to stick two hundred dollars per coin if you have ten thousand dollars and you want to trade ten coins if you so desire it simply means you want to uh, stake one thousand dollars per coin so it solely depends on you don't let anybody tell you this is a perfect trade settings for hundred dollars for two hundred dollars for three hundred dollars if you have hundred dollars you may decide to do what to use the hundred dollars to to, to to trade a coin and also you may also decide to use the what to use the hundred dollars to trade two coins it is yours and yours alone to decide so let's assume now that i have hundred dollars here i'll just use hundred dollars uh, i have hundred dollars i'll just use ten dollars i'll use ten dollars margin call limit oh i can put uh i can put two so once i put two i come here to margin configuration first call when it's 3.5 percent deep uh buy i buy what buy two or i can choose three more buy three three times ten is what is 30 and uh four when it's uh four percent deep i can i say because we have three times ten which is 30 plus one the first call the initial call itself which is uh or four i can say what buy six more times and that is what that is hundred six times ten is sixty three times ten is thirty plus ten the initial one that is what that is hundred it's as simple as that i can also decide i can say i want the call limit to be what to be five and once there's five i can say okay uh, buy uh for five i can say once it's bought the first time which is one i can say okay buy additional two year that's three uh buy additional two year that's uh five buy additional uh two year that is seven then i can say buy two year that is nine so if i say buy two year that will be 10 11 then i can then choose what i can choose one year so this is one two of oh, this is one plus two this three this five this seven this nine then plus the initial one that is ten so ten times ten is what is hundred as simple as that so and if i don't want to do that even if i have one thousand dollars i can choose go for these settings for what for 10 different coins that will still make it one thousand dollars i can choose to do what if i have two two hundred dollars all you have to do is just what changes to 20. if i want to stake 200 dollars with this coin change it to 20. it's as simple as that if what i want to do is i want to uh, use my one thousand dollars and i want to spend everything on this coin what i have to do is what change it to 100 100 times 10 because we had five calls here and we have to we are we change it i did not save it the other time and you can set one two 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 uh and which will be nine plus one that's a uh, ten ten times hundred is one thousand if it's ten thousand you can change it to one thousand or you can split the one thousand into uh into five places which will be two thousand each and you can set this one to two hundred and what and set it to be what two hundred in what maybe in five places that will be 1000 you can uh 200 200 in 10 places that will be 2000 and 2000 in five places i mean five coins will be worth 
could be 10,000. So it's just as simple as that. So it solely depends on you. It depends on you. And I want to say that you either you have hundred dollars, whether you have two hundred dollars, whether you have one thousand dollars, it is what is the same settings. All you have to do what all you have to understand is what is the first buy amount, the margin call limit, and the margin configuration. So once you've done that, what you have to do is what is what click save. And once you click save, you do what you click one shot. If, a, if there's a cycle here, then that means you're using one shot already. But if there's one shot here, click one shot and do what and start. And that is all. Let me show you an example with a trade that is currently ongoing. You can see there's cycle. It's, you can see what's on top, one shot. So, and you start, yes. And I want to tell you, I'm saying you should use one shot because that is one of the safest ways to trade on this robot. If you cycle, the cycle will continue till most likely when it gets you into trouble when it you you will have to wait a longer time maybe days five days six days seven days before you can get profit and get out of a trade which i believe is not the best for you and if you want to watch the video on how to use the difference between one shot and cycle you can just check the screen above or check the description below to do what to check my video on difference between cycle and one shot and which one you should make use of and i want to say once again that i hope this video is helpful and if you are to register for the royal key robot and you want to register i'll be glad to welcome you on my team we are with the world we share with you enticing things things that will make you what attain financial independence in the quickest and the safest way possible thank you once again my name is for i want to hold you to subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notification bell so you can get access to enriching content from me. Thank you and God bless.